So I have two different firearm system here. Well, I guess three, but we're only going to have a look at two. This right here is a 40 Smith & Wesson, and if you look down the barrel of this cleared and empty firearm, you will see what we call rifling. These are little grooves that are cut into the barrel itself to help spin a projectile as it goes out of the barrel, and that spin of the projectile helps stabilize it to get much more accurate shots, especially out at longer distances. Now, that's a rifled barrel, and more often than not, you're going to see firearms that have rifled barrels unless we talk about shotguns. Shotguns tend to have smoothbore barrels. There are rifled shotgun barrels out there, but uh, for the most part, uh, shotguns are going to fire things like this, like buckshot and birdshot or rifled slugs, and that's best fired out of a smoothbore. A smoothbore, if we take a look at our shotgun here, there is no rifling inside of this barrel here. It is just a straight sewer pipe. And, uh, well, there's nothing in there to stabilize or spin a bullet.